so and so i want to encourage somebody who is struggling today with your insecurities or things that you hate about yourself i want to say to you that you know i know that you hear it all the while but you are truly beautiful and wonderful um and i want to tell you that you know spending time with god's word um um i was in a lot of bible studies with my friends shout out to the tribe family and we did and we did a lot of Bible studies there where we talked about um, self-love and insecurities and all them some there. And they really helped me and, and that really helped me and it really started to help me to appreciate myself more. And you know, stop stop put down myself because um because my skin is just skin. <laughs> because my skin is just skin and it's who I am and I started to love that about myself. I started to focus on the positives about um, my flaws. And so and so I want to encourage somebody who is struggling today with your insecurities or things that you hate about yourself. I want to say to you that, you know, I know that you hear it all the while, but you are truly beautiful and wonderful in me. Um, and I want to tell you that read more of God's word and you read him word and then you realize that this the God that made the entire world is telling me that I am beautiful I'm like no not on opinion no matter no more <laughs> I'm not on opinion no matter no more and I want to tell you to encourage I want to tell you to surround yourself with amazing people don't surround yourself with your friends that that um that go point out your insecurities in a bad way and try to bring you down further because you don't need that. You don't need that. So surround yourself with amazing, positive people who will love you for who you are. And I want to, and I want to leave with you these words that my friend Trish told me when I was complaining about my skin, <laughs> and I was crying, and I was just venting to her, and she, and she told me that, you know, even without skin, you'd still be beautiful. And that really remained with me, and I will forever remember it. So I love you, Trish. Um, I want you to know that, you know, you're not alone. I'm sure there are a lot more people that are struggling with the same thing that you struggle with, that feel insecure about the same thing that you feel insecure about. So, you know, go ahead, seek help, reach out to somebody, and God loves you, and so do I. Bye.